let's run the titles first. Get that out of the way and then we'll talk. Alright, it's gonna be one of those videos where I'm gonna talk to you guys. Because um, there's something that I've been contemplating that has an effect on our relationship we have here. You know, the vlog consists of a lot of my family, a lot of my kids, a lot of... I bring you home to us and, and especially with, with the children. I had an interesting conversation with a friend of mine who said, well, where's the line? Are, are, aren't you just using your kids for hits and, 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 and clicks? It says something about the thing that we call social media. To me, social media is a platform. It's a media, it's a medium. It's, it's, it's one of the many me media we have. In school, we're very conscious of that. It's just a vehicle. It's just something you get into. You can go from A to B with all kinds of vehicles. This thing is just a vehicle. I don't know what social media is other than the choice you make it to be. It's you decide what it is. Just like on a movie screen, the movie screen, the cinema, it brought us 2001 Space Odyssey and it brought us Beverly Hills Chihuahua too. I mean, they couldn't be, but it's the same thing. It's the same media. It's a, it's, it's, it's a movie theater, just like TV. You have documentaries, you have short films, you have series, you have reality TV. You, you don't blame the media for what it is that people are doing with it. It's ultimately the responsibility of the maker in the consumer of what it is. And to me, social media isn't about gossip or negativity or, or trying to get hits and be famous and everything. I've never done anything like that. I made movies. I'm making a movie for the theater. I'm making a movie for TV. I, ma I made movies for the internet. I made commercials for brands. It's, it doesn't... I'm never... Is it on my mind that I would it's just another platform to share what it is that I'm making, what I want to share, what I want to express. I view the vlog as an intimate series, an intimate documentary series that I would make for any other television. I'm using my own family because that's my life, because that I, that's what I find the most interesting. And if you look at my work, I always take myself and what it is that's going on in my life and translate it somehow. This is pretty obvious and on the nose because it's me, it's my kids, my life. But the documentary I'm making is about me as well with my father and my son and everything. It's not unheard of for us filmmakers to use ourselves as the subject or as the theme of a movie, of a work and everything. On the other hand, you can't be naive on what this social media thing is. There's one thing that is different from all other media. It's the comments. It's immediate. People comment on your work immediately and it's anonymous it's it's from afar it's it's just easy in the key keyboard and I don't know what I would think would happen if a lot more people would watch the vlog and comment on my kids or my wives and and hate on them and everything I'm in a pretty sweet spot right now only you guys my family my friends, my faraway friends, my family in Baghdad, Iraq watches this, which is one of the reasons why I'm doing this in English as well. But I can't lie to you that I, I am trying to broaden my audience. Please have a relationship with whatever it is you're watching, especially on social media. Treat it the same way you would any other relationship in your life. It's about respect. It's about context. It's about it's about people, they're people, and, and don't assume that on social media there's only crap or on social media nobody wants to listen to any substance, nobody wants to, uh, it's, it only has to be very short, very flashy, very this, very that. It can be anything it is you want. It's up to us. It's up, up to us, the creator and the consumer, the maker and the audience. Never in history did we filmmakers have so much opportunity to share our ideas? The whole system, if you see what it takes for me to make a movie in the mainstream system, in the TV system, or the film world, I mean, 
every day I'm making a movie from start to finish. On the other side, I'm making one and two, three, four, five years. This thing is beautiful. This thing opens so opens up so much opportunities to just make and share and be creative and have your work into the world. But somehow, it seems that we've decided that social media is bad, that it's an unsafe place. It's a part of who we are, it's a translation from our world. It's, it could be safe, it could be beautiful, it can inspire, it can make business. But don't approach this thing like it's, it can, it's one thing. If you want to share intimate details of your life and you want to do it in an authentic way, don't do it of to be famous or for effect or sensationalist, then it will backfire, I guarantee. But if it's honest and it's authentic and it comes from a good place, then it's fine. And there's always, there always will be people who hate on you, who, who judge you or anything. That's, they do that anyway in the real world as well. I would hate it if this medium that we now have labeled social media, that, that we have our mind made up about it. That is just a place of gossip, of commerce, of, of people who want to be famous, who, who need attention. It can be so much more than that. It's not my intention to change what me, social media is, it's just my intention to use it to share. But let's be responsible. Let's be conscious about this thing that we're doing together. Is it safe for me to share intimate details of my life and my and show my kids on social media? It is, as long as I do it from a with well intention, from a good heart, good place, and as you guys see it and watch it with the same intention, with the same good heart and place. And up until now, it's only that. And I'm really happy about it. My, my vision for the future is maybe I will move the vlog to another medium because if YouTube continues to stand out in the masses by doing insane stuff like filming dead people and doing all kind of click baits and everything, then it's not my place. I will move it somewhere else. But at the time, I will let you know where that is. And by that point, we know that this relationship wasn't treated with respect. But that's the way it goes, right? I want to leave you with a happy note. Is that I'm really, that this vlog is absolutely one of my favorite things to do. At, I, I mean, it's a drag at times. I admit, it's a lot of work. It's a lot of creating all the time, off days. And not if you make a video every day, then not all of it will be winners. But... The experience of it is absolutely amazing. The reactions from you guys is absolutely amazing. And as long as we keep that up, it's all good. Thank you.